All right, this post-game video wrap-up was brought to you by St. Francis Medical Center. I'm here with Kyle Fisher, the star of the Steinert's victory over Princeton. And Kyle, I guess one interception wasn't good enough. You had to get two men. <laughs> Always helps. Talk about what those uh, those two plays, you, uh, what you saw. One was obviously kind of a batted ball. You kind of saw it in the air. The other one just kind of went up and skied it. Talk about those uh, two interceptions. Uh, the one in the air, uh, I think it was Dan Scoley. He made a nice play, getting his hands up. I just saw the ball in the air and just instinct. He went and get the ball and tried to get the offense in a great field position to score. And the ball in the air, just, I saw I saw Beamer throw it. Beamer's a great quarterback, but it was in the air. I just jumped up. I came down with it. Now, you also had a good offensive day, so to speak. Uh, that, that big punt, the end around, kind of got the offense going a little bit in the first half. Uh, talk about that uh, that play a little bit as well. Was it was it a planned call? Or is yeah, it... it was a planned call. I mean, we've seen on film that they, uh, the motion, they didn't really run with that. And right. we practice special teams every day at practice. And our special teams coordinator, Coach Harris, does a great job with that every day. It makes great calls. You know, it seemed like even after your two picks, Beamer and this offense was kind of still targeting you. Did you feel like they were, they were still going after you? Was it because you were... Were you on green the whole day, or what do you think it was? I mean, I think they just do play football. If they see an opportunity, they take it. And at one play, I got beat. I put that on me. Beamer made a nice throw, and the receiver made a nice catch, and they ended up scoring on it. You guys had two wins last year. You had three already this year. How good does it feel now to be 3-1, and one, uh, going, going to league play at a big game next week against Nottingham? It feels great to go in with momentum, coming off another win for next week. All right, Kyle, for your efforts, you receive a free hoagie. Comments to the Italian People's Bakery at 63 Bella Street in Trenton, New Jersey, the pride of the Berg. Kyle, congrats on a great win, man. Thank you.